Want to make your text glow? Please keep watching this video. Hey guys, it's Jun from Illustrator How. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to apply a glow effect in Adobe Illustrator. You can use the same method to make a glow effect on text or objects. I'm actually going to show you two ways to make a glow text effect in Adobe Illustrator. The first way is super easy. Well, obviously the first step is to add text to Adobe Illustrator. Select the text, go to the overhead menu and choose effect. Stylize and choose outer glow. And obviously you have to choose the color that you want the text to glow. I'm just going to add like maybe a pink like this. I know it's not so obvious. You will be changing the area of the glow by changing the blur value. If you put it to 10, you can check the preview bottom and see how it looks. Or maybe 20. So as you increase the blur value, you will see more glow area. And you can also play with the mode. Feel free to explore uh, the blend mode options and click OK. OK, now I'm going to show you the second way to make a glow effect in Adobe Illustrator. And I personally prefer this method because you can create more of like a realistic glow and you can make nylon text using this method as well. Okay, I'm going to lock the background for now so that you don't move it by accident. You can use a keyboard shortcut command and two, number two, to lock the background and duplicate the text. Make a copy of the text. I'm going to command C, command V. I'm going to move it down for now since we are not going to use it. And now let's start making this text glow. So before actually start, you do need to have an idea of what color of the glowing effect that you want. Um, if you want like a pinkish glow effect, you will change the text color to pink. I'm going to choose this pink here or maybe a little bit lighter pink. Okay, and then you need to make a copy of the text again. So you can use the shortcut command C, or you can go to the edit menu and choose copy. And again, go to the edit menu or use a keyboard shortcut. What you need to do is to paste in place. And we will be using the effect menu, blur and Gaussian blur. The first copy of the text, the radius should be a little bit smaller. I'm going to choose two pixels and make a copy again. So you will be placing the text again. I'm going to use a shortcut Shift, Command and V to place it in front and then go to Effect, Blur, Gaussian Blur again to choose a slightly bigger pixel. Five. Just repeat the step maybe five or six times. And each time, remember, you will be increasing the pixels. This time I'm going to put seven. All right, so once you get something like this, now you can move this text above. Oh, I'm going to first arrange it. Um, right click, arrange and bring to front. Or use a keyboard shortcut, shift, command and the right bracket. And you can move the text here. So that's a much better glow effect, I would say, than the method before. And there's other things that you can do to make it even look better. So for example, you, if you want to make maybe the background, the text a little bit brighter, so you can actually add a gradient on the background. So I'm going to unlock this um, background color, go to object, unlock, and then I'm going to choose a gradient tool. And here I'm going to choose a gradient type to the radial gradient. And I'm going to change this color, maybe not so dark. So maybe you can make a gradient effect like this. If you don't like how it looks, let's go back. I'm just going to choose the background color again. If you don't like how it looks, there's another way. So all you need to do is create a circle. And instead of changing the whole background color, you can change this background color. And I'm going to use a Gaussian blur again. And actually you can create a blur like this 
and arrange it to back. See how it looks. Change opacity a little bit. And if you can change the blend mode, and I think it looks much better right now. Then you can always go back to play with the gradient color if you don't like the color. If you want to learn more about how to make a text glow in Adobe Illustrator, I do have an article where I talk about three ways to make something glow in Adobe Illustrator and you can follow the step by step a little bit easier. So I'll have the link in the description below. Feel free to check that out. All right, so this is how you can make something glow in Adobe Illustrator. Hope you find this video helpful. If you do like this video, don't forget to give me a thumb up and hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my future tutorials.